Inside the large concert hall, the final part of the acoustic design is coming together. Over 10,000 specially designed acoustic tiles will line the walls and balconies of the auditorium. The design is abstract and modern. But these tiles owe their shape to a concept that dates back centuries. Research reveals that it's not just the shoebox shape that gives classical concert halls their superb sound. The decorations along the walls are just as important. When sound waves hit the plaster decorations, they scatter in different directions. This creates multiple reflections, giving a more even, natural sound. For the Elbe Philharmonie, Herzog and de Muron have created their own modern equivalent that they call the white skin. Their specially developed fibre-reinforced gypsum tiles can be individually micro-shaped to create acoustic reflections to Mr. Toyota's exact specifications. By scattering sound, you know, we can get a very even uh, distribution over the uh, audience area. Under Mr. Toyota's guidance, the architects developed the pattern on the white skin, tile by tile. Every tile is different. Um, it's a, that was part of the whole micro-shaping idea. So we started analyzing each wall with him, understanding more depth here meant more dispersion, less depth meant more direct reflection, and by doing that, we kind of optimized acoustically every wall for his needs. It's taken over 350 million lines of computer programming to produce this vast three-dimensional jigsaw. Every one of the 10,287 tiles is different, but their patterns must all line up. It's basically like going back to childhood with a huge Meccano set. Everything is numbered, labelled, there's a sequence as to how things are done. For Nick Lyons, this is a tense time. If the tiles don't fit together perfectly, it will be a major setback. They started about six months ago and they've been mounting in a kind of a spiral form, working their way up to the tip. I'm really surprised at the precision, I have to say. It just fitted. I mean, everything fitted. Of course, there was a little bit of shaving here and there, but in general, it was, it was a set piece. It was fantastic. And at last, it seems the rows over money are behind them. Progress has been fast and, and impressive, and it's especially after such a long wait. It's wonderful to see the, uh, the progress of the construction. Yeah, it's going on well. The building is starting to look good, but no one really knows if the extraordinary acoustic design will work until the first concert takes place. <laughs>